pants falling off you? Good morning, guys. I'm trying to get these kids out of the house. I know, I'll do it. Get your backpack. She'll do it, huh? Have a good day at school, okay? Okay. All right, you know Grandma loves you. Okay? Mommy, fix your pants in the car. Okay. Have a good day. Good morning. Oh, my God. I've got hair in my eye. Yeah. I'm going to turn on the heat. Buckle up. Buckle up. But, but Marcus, um, she is too close to me. Okay, well, we'll fix it later. Buckle up. Take off your backpack. This is more time. This. And I feel that. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. There we go. I am in the Starbucks line trying to give me and my mother something. I have to shoot today with all deaf digital. I have my call time is 9 o'clock. So I want to get me something, go home, shower, put on makeup, and then head out. But this line for Starbucks is real right now. Of the cars I can see, because I only like to do the drive-through, there are one, two, three, four, five, six cars in front of me. There are cars in the drive-through, and that usually fits maybe four. So there's probably 10 cars in front of me. That's how like crazy we be going in out here for these Starbucks. And I don't even drink coffee. Did y'all know that? I don't drink coffee. But they have something I like, so I drink that. I love chai tea. I like their refreshers, but it's cold. It's only 46 degrees, so we're gonna get that chai tea today. And I'm gonna hook my mama up, because I'm a good daughter. Y'all, so I made it to work. I get all my stuff out. The wind is loud in here. Working black folk. I make it out of my car. The wind is blowing so hard that it knocks my car key out of my car underneath the truck all the way to the very middle. So I literally have to lay on the ground and Mission Impossible scoop my body underneath the truck to get the key. I did get it because I'm not about that life and I have my car key because we've had it happen once before. But um. Yeah, I don't really know. Oh, what's well, you know what I'm saying? We up in here. You, you know what I'm saying? To the death. To the death. You know what I'm saying? We gonna get that rude. I don't even know who he is. There's Patrick. I mean, I'm so, seeing you so often now. I know, right? I know. Yeah, it's Vlogmas, <laughs> so I got to get the footage. Yeah. This place is really pretty. It's Dream Studios in Canoga Park. I was a little worried when they said Canoga Park because I've been out of in Canoga Park before and not everything is this nice. A little pretty Christmas tree. But anyways, I'm gonna fill out my paperwork. And uh, then I'll be ready to rock and roll. So I am already at Home Depot because work was super quick. It's not even 11 o'clock yet. Um, I actually ran to a place called the Dollar Tree and got tins for the cookies. I always put the cookies in like Christmas tins. Now I'm at Home Depot to get my mother shower head, a new shower head for a shower. One that she can like take off and like move around since she'll be <clears throat> using only one arm here for the next six weeks. Make it a little bit easier for her to get some of the hard to reach places. Also, I wanna get some real poinsettias. Um, because my husband was basically trashing the poinsettias that we had at home. So, anyways, those are the two things. So hopefully, oh sorry, hopefully I'll get the right type of uh, shower head. I'm gonna send a picture to Marcus before I buy. Oh, these are fake. I was about to say these are pretty cute. I don't think I want fake ones. I think I want real ones. But is it like a waste of money to get a real one? These are cheap. Well, then that one isn't. But these are only $8. That could be pretty on our porch. No? What do you think? Because I can always add glitter to it. 
Because that's the big difference, I think, between this and that. Is that this one has some glitter ones. Oh, this is the same price. Oh. I'm not sure yet. Somebody was way too close to my car and to my wallet. Cause I saw my camera work got all funky there for a second. Cause I was like, back up. But let me get the shower here first. Oh, there's more points at us. Okay. I know where to look when I'm ready. I bless you. These are the real. No, these are fake too. Are these real? These look fake. No, these are real. Oh, these are cheaper. These are six ninety nine. These are pretty, and these are real. I'm getting these real ones. Absolutely. <laughs> oh my god! Sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh yes. Yeah. Perfect. So this is the current shower head. Um, it's shiny gold, so I need to get something that's polished, not gold, silver, shiny silver. So I want to get shiny silver instead of br brush like up here. It's not focusing. This brush, I need shiny like this. But my husband said a single attachment. So. Hopefully I can find something because we don't need the little turn part. We just need the shower head. Hmm. Let's see what I okay, This is what I needed. The ones that pull with the cord. So I got to figure out which one. Let me call my husband and see if he can help me out. Because I need to make sure I get the right one because I'm not going to make do this. <laughs> well, doesn't that just look festive with the poinsettias? I think I probably got to switch the order of the um, wood. And the point set over here and it just looks nice right Ugh, i love it all right let me show y'all the tins i got for these cookies this is what i, I always get them from the dollar store because it's like why pay more why pay more than a dollar the stuff i ain't gonna ever get back so because some of my reps are jewish i try to get things that aren't just like Christmas, but like more winter themed. So I got some snowman, some joy, Noel, um, season's greetings, gingerbread men. I did get Christmas trees for, cause I'm also gonna give some to the twins teacher and little Marcus's teacher. This one is saying, I usually like getting these, the ones that you can see through, but this was the only one that was left. And that's it. So I'm gonna pack these cookies in. So it's for my theatrical agent, my commercial agent, my manager, and his assistant, and the kids' um, teachers. So got all the cookies in these little containers. I'm about to put them in their tins, and then they'll be ready. To oh, I got fancy. So uh -huh. Reggie's here about to show us how to use this ice machine for Mom's recovery. Ready? Okay. All right. So what we're gonna do? is we're gonna fill it up with water to the first line. Okay. Okay. And then we're gonna fill it up with ice to the second line. Okay. okay. Got it. And you put the lid on like that. Mm -hmm. This locks it into place. Do Once you hear it lock or you just, what does it go? Okay, it doesn't it matter. It just goes, just okay, goes just like, like an old school igloo. Okay. Yeah, 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 okay. that's what I say. It's like yeah. old school igloo. Okay, so you go ahead and plug this into the wall. Okay. Once it's plugged in, this is gonna be your on and off switch. Oh, okay, just pulling it on, out. And, uh -huh. Off. Oh. <laughs> okay? Okay. Simple. Yep. Okay. okay? It's going to be for an hour on, an hour off. An okay. hour on, an okay. hour off throughout the whole day. Okay. You change out the water and ice every six hours. Okay. And you want this uh, to be, um, is she sitting in a chair or, or a recliner? This is her. She's yeah. the she. Oh, in a recliner. Uh, you want it in a chair next to you. Okay. Uh, so the pump isn't working so hard. So you want it at the same height as what you're saying? Yeah, is that as at her, wherever she's... Assuming. Wherever her hip is? Yes. Okay, got it. So you want the tabs to be up. 
Okay. Audio. When you connect. Mm. Okay. And then the disconnect. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And then a reconnect tabs up. Tabs up. Okay. okay. So tabs stay up while it's in operation. Correct. Okay, got it. All right. This right here, you're only going to take this with you to surgery. Okay. When you wake up, you're going to have this on. So you're going to have your, your buddy, the sling. Mm -hmm. Okay. And this. Okay. On you. Really? Yes, ma'am. Okay, good. So when you, when you come home, you just lock and load and rock and roll. Okay. Okay. And then when the sling comes, when does your sling come off? Six weeks. Six weeks. So that'll stay on for six weeks? Uh, this one, you can take it off at night. Okay. Uh, if you can. If if not, try to have it as much as possible because, okay, so the reason why she's like this for six weeks mm -hmm. is so it could heal. Right. Okay. The reason this is so awesome is because it's going to numb the area to reduce the inflammation and the pain. Because any little movement is going to kill. Heal. Okay, so is that going over or under the sling? Um, the sling is covered right here, mm -hmm. and it's open. Open, and that goes right there. Okay, perfect. Okay, okay. got it. Well, they told me to put a towel if I did ice packs. Does a towel need to go into that? So you have a, you have a bandage. You it's going to be a bandage. You have a big old bandage. Mm -hmm. when, once you take the, the bandage off, uh, get uh, like a men's old white t-shirt, okay. something thin, and and that, that can be your bearing. And that'll be, so the bandage is enough of a bearing at first, and See. then when the bandage comes off, an old white t-shirt is yes. what we need to put underneath there. Okay. Well, so, I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. What's up, family? It's like almost <laughs> 7 o'clock. Uh, my husband still isn't home. My mother just got home. I'm in the middle of fi fixing a vegan Dinner, Jesus. Here, you lay sideways so I can actually get this done. Well, they like it. And I'm gonna know if you all remember these things. My son wanted to know if I knew how to do it. It's been a That's long time. Mine. Probably not gonna be that great. So let's see. It's mine. Yes, it's size. Okay, so you start off with it on here. Mm -hmm. And then you, whoop. Oh, you gotta stay still. Still, you gotta. Oh, <laughs> oh God, it's hard to do with a baby in your arm. You're trying to bounce it off the top right, over and over again. Here, let's see. But let's see if that you helps. are messing it up. I know I'm messing it. Watch out! I don't want to hit you. Oh, you can actually do it. Hold on. Hold on. That's what I've been trying to do. Why you is the ball have... so hard? What we do, mommy? <laughs> still do that i haven't seen one of these in so long like i know i had to be 10. i had to be little marcus oh, of course the baby is not having it no you cannot do that you cannot let him go babe i didn't know it jesus babe about to bust his face oh, all up on it no, let me get off it so I have successfully made oh, another vegan dinner. This is a look at this. vegan like burritos. I don't know what you really want to call it. I guess it's a burrito. Well, I got the baby didn't rub lipstick. Jesus. So it's just corn, brown, black beans, I mean. Um, green onion, cilantro. I put some garlic in there. Cumin, paprika, and smoked paprika. Then rice. And um, lettuce, salsa, avocado, or me and my husband. Then I'm going to add a flavor that might not actually work with it, but we're going to give it a try. I'm going to add a little bit of chipotle aioli. I'll let y'all know how that tastes. But the kids are eating theirs, they're not complaining. I don't like corn, but they're, yeah. they're doing just fine with corn. So what's good, family? Y'all know what I just realized? This is the end of the vlog. Um, I said earlier, maybe maybe it was like beginning of November, by Christmas I would have hardwood floors in the den. I don't think that's going to happen. Not by Christmas of this year. No, it might happen shortly after, maybe sometime, sometime in January. It just now hit me. I was like, I don't know when I'm going to have time to do that. 
um because actually i still need to go look at the material that was ordered at the sample material that was ordered from another place uh, one of the places i went to they actually did the kitchens uh floors at our old house yeah anyway y'all it's wrapping up the vlog i'm about to get in this bed uh we got angel's mom's uh surgery tomorrow so Hopefully everything goes good with that. By the time y'all see this, I believe she will be out of surgery by then. So be praying for her. Um, yeah, and here's to that. I'm gonna have someone else to take care of for a little while. Nah, I'm just joking. Um, yeah, y'all have a good one. I'm going to bed.